My name is Onobu Sayo Adidi, the CEO of Serious Group Africa. We are a pan African innovative investment banking firm involved in advisory and uh, trusteeship and equally asset management. And also, we have um, our player in serving the SME space through our microfinance bank platform. We are into innovative financial services and providing solution across Africa and also empowering Africa prosperity. Thank you. Well, thank you, sir. Congratulations on winning the fastest uh, growing corporate trustees in Nigeria award, 2024. And can you tell us what this award means to you? Yeah, this award actually is the second time in a row. We won it last year as well. And that shows the appreciation of our services for the market. We are very proud of actually having this award in our group. The trust firm has actually been doing wonderfully well. And through that, we have brought innovative um, products into the market. And this award actually shows that, yes, the market has received our products very well. And it shows to us that we are to do more and to continue to actually commit to innovative products in trust services in Nigeria and even across Africa. Yeah, corporate trusteeship is not... What do you do? What do you do? What do okay. you do? As, it, as corporate trusteeship, there are three levels of trusteeship. We have the public trust space, we have the corporate trust space, and then we have the private trust space. And the public trust space, we serve as intermediary and represent investors in public issuances and government bonds as well. And in the corporate trust space, we serve as security trustees whereby organizations who come to the market to actually raise funds, um, put um, securities in, in trust of trustees, and also um, will represent the interest of the borrowers who actually ensures, uh, we represent the interest of the lenders and ensuring that the borrowers actually repay and then in case of default, the lenders are not left without uh, a security interest. So the trustees actually fill that space of ensuring and bringing comfort into the venture transaction. And also in the private trustees, we manage estates and then we help people to actually plan for their future. And also we hold assets on behalf of beneficiaries. So that's what we basically do. But what we have done is to actually bring innovative way, introduce technology to this process, and also we are actually brought collaborative ways by which the services are rendered, and then the needs of the investors are met the creative way. What would you say are, are, would be the three biggest deals you've done in the, in the last pocket? Okay. Okay. In a couple of years that we've been involved, we've been involved in um, about two very um, very big deals. Who's essentially this year? We're involved in the 22.5 billion um, transaction by um, one of the state governments in Nigeria, and um, also the the first uh, state green bonds. We are also on that transaction. Um, that is still in the works, but um, since our inception, about three years ago, when we joined the trusteeship industry. We have actually been involved in different like transactions, which I cannot, but like I mentioned, yes, from a 22.5 billion, and then there is another 20 billion that we're involved in as well. Yeah, and then when you see the next milestone to be working toward. Okay, okay. in terms of um, that, would that involve in secrets anyway? <laughs> that, the, the next milestone or the next um, uh, trajectory yes, we have yes, actually yes. set for ourselves, we want to be one of the three top uh, trusteeship uh, companies in Nigeria within a space of our uh, five years operation. Now we are three years with, with, between now and the uh, fifth year of operation, we want to be among the top three uh, trust companies, if not the, the first. 
and also we're not looking at operating within Nigeria oil alone. We are looking at growing into the emerging market in Africa because Africa's prosperity is actually our watchword. We believe that fixing Africa's infrastructural gap can only be done by the African self. And so our coming into this space is to actually bridge whatever the gaps are, both within the Anglophone and the Francophone, within the African space. So our intention is to actually have a dominant place within the financial services sector in both Nigeria and Africa. Thank you very much. I think we're Thank you so, so much. Uh, yeah.